wanted to get y'all masks. Y'all got y'all masks. I want to just film real quick what why you what y'all think about this. How am I supposed to act? Wow. What you think about that? Like can can I put you on? You okay answering yeah. what you think about that? I, I, so you I'm, see what it say. What you think about that? You I'm a parent? A, I am a parent. I'm out mm -hmm. here with my kids fishing. <laughs> there go her young but, people over there. Right. It's very deep. And uh, why is that? Because parents are supposed to protect and provide for their kids. And they really can't do that if they're mm. under substance abuse or any type of abuse, substance abuse. That's kind of hard to protect your own kids or so you're not stable yourself. 248 murders right now in Chicago. Yeah. Do you feel any impact of that? Yeah. Is it any hope? Mm -hmm. But well, some people tell me no. So try, I get a different ass depending on who you ask. So. Yeah, because they're in the inner city and they feel like there's no hope because mm -hmm. there's so much that's going on. Mm -hmm. and they see it on a daily basis. Mm -hmm. But so what keeps you from feeling to, that? Why you don't feel like it's hope? I have kids mm -hmm. and I have to show them a positive side and I have to let them know that there's some hope. You know, you always have to believe that there's hope. Okay. If you believe that there is no hope, then you know. We would have civil rights and all that. Our ancestors so, had it far worse, right? right? So, so who are we to not believe to? believe that there's hope. Right. You never can right. not believe this that. This is one of the leaders right here. <laughs> Claudette, this is a parent. And I just asked, was there any hope? And she gave the right answer. <laughs> what she said. Hey, I'm here. She a parent, so yeah, she said she's I'm not going to never give up hope. <laughs> now, where your mask at? You got a mask? Yeah, Let me put it on real quick. I want to get the mask so people can see that. Y'all see what a mask say? All right. And yours say the innocence was stolen. Ooh. Mm. Can I get your comment on this one? That's heavy. You see that? Yes, it is. What you think about that? Is it real? Does this happen? Oh, it happened in my family, so I know it's real. So it happens in a lot of people's family. They just don't say anything about it. Wow. They cover it up. But it happens. So what's this? How can a girl recover? If that wasn't her, but what if that was her? How, how can how, how, what, what can she do? She can it's speak deep. about it to somebody she trusts. I believe she, yeah. Left. Yeah, I would have to tell her soulfully, like, she do need to speak to someone about it. Is it her fault? It's not her fault, no. but it's never your fault. But that's what shame is. Shame means something you I did. Internalize it. Yeah. Right. So it's not their fault, um, but they should talk to someone, communicate. Don't. a victor. Yes. No longer a victim. I had a person real close to me. She was raped. All of that that happened to her. And she wrote a book. And she was on Mari Povich's show and other shows. So that's the key. Take the power back. Yeah. Go out yeah. and tell your story. Because you can prevent tell that it. next person tell from yeah. doing it. But I didn't it. see that one. Uh-oh, 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 uh-oh. Put it. You painted this one? Uh-uh. All right. Because I, I like to know what made y'all paint them. Did you paint yours or they just, okay, yeah. Because we did, we went to the school and they painted them. I wanted to get their thoughts on that. But thank you for the for your comments and everything. And you, I tell you, we got an audience that view these all over. And what you said as a parent will make a difference to some other parents I dealing with the so. same thing. Always hope. Excellent. All right.